Hey there, I'm Mr. Terry, a high school history teacher. Welcome back to another History Teacher Reacts video. All right, I'm excited to cover another Starve Harv bad translations video. We've looked at overall history. We've looked at World War II. We've looked at the Cold War. Now it's World War I time. And World War I is my favorite of the modern war conflicts to talk about. So I'm really excited to see how the translations get screwed up in this one. All right, please, please, please make sure you have viewed the Starve Harv video first before checking this out because his concept is fantastic. I want to make sure he gets the view and make sure you give him a subscription. All right, be sure at the end of this video, if you haven't seen my other coverage of Starve Harv videos, check those out and let's get started. All right, wartime, you know what that means. Got to get the helmet on. Here we go, the war to end all wars. I took Wikipedia's timeline of World War I and ran it through Google Translate using languages with the worst translation quality. <laughs> this was the result. June 28th, 1914. Archduke Franz Ferdinand, heir to the throne of Austria-Hungary. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, Gavrilo, true, true. Princess of Bosnia. Oh! Wife of Prince <laughs> Holmberg of Sarajevo. Wait, wait, hold on. Um, is there... Okay, so Gavrilo Princeps, the assassin um, of, of, of uh, Franz Ferdinand, is there any translation where, where, um, where like princip means princess of any other languages? Let me know if that's actually the case or not. That's, that's funny though. Assassination of Safia. July 5th, during the war between Sophia? Germany and Serbia. Well, Sophia's his wife, or Sophie was his wife. Uh, that must be what they're talking about. So yeah, that, it, they, uh, he assassinated both of them. Of they're in the Safia. Car. July 5th. During the war between Germany and Serbia, Russia asked for the help of Austria-Hungary. Support from the German government. He was sent to Serbia, but he, refused. He's back! Urgh. We love he. He is him. In the comment section, I'm loving it. You guys are putting in all the uh, all the different, like, like who is he? And I'm getting all these these different, like, explanations of who he is. It's so funny to look at. Keep doing that, you guys. I want, I want to nail down he to as specifically as possible about who this character is i, I remember in the one video oh, i forgot who it was didn't he say who he was yeah anyways we got to keep it open to interpretation and was forced German government he was sent to serbia but refused <laughs> and was forced to fight against austria <laughs> invite austria and russia please they want to play willie and nikki kaiser yeah. named prince william the second prince of germany that's how they referred to each other in the letters to each other leading up to the uh, the um, declarations of war. So they're cousins, if you didn't know that. Uh, yes. <laughs> like all the monarchs were basically rated. All of them, their grandmother was Queen Victoria of England. It's very much a, a, a family feud, but they were actually first cousins. So, and it was Tsar Nicholas, right? And then Kaiser Wilhelm. And they would refer to each other in the letter, in the letters, like, dear Nikki, dear Willie, which is, it sounds so funny because it's like, they're about to go to the brutal, most brutal war in world history up to that point, and it, it's so like informal sounding how they dress each other. And Nicole, the second prince of Russia, August second, uh, like, light know. Sambor <laughs> attacked the Germans. August ah, third, light Sambor. the Germans invaded Belgium and besieged France. German pancakes. Mm. August seventh, Germany defeated Britain and France with five armies in the last war. No, nope, never defeated France. That was quick. August 8th. <laughs> that was the goal. They wanted to be done by Christmas, but those dang Russians will mobilize too fast. So Germany had to uh, put troops in the east as well as the west, which is something they never wanted to do is don't didn't want to fight a two front war. Black is the symbol of the German war. Makes August sense. August 9th. This war? Yes. August 17th. Supporters of his work <laughs> are working hard to find the original text of this statement. It's kind of meta, don't you think? How does it know? August 21st. His editing's getting better, by the way. Hardly fought in Charleroi. <laughs> also on August 21st, Aldrin Bynum struggled. Oh, Aldrin. August 26th. Understand. August 29th. Guns of August, man. All this stuff happening in that first month. The Battle of St. John was a united war. Oh, they all A actually. black war. Also August 29th, the first Mafia war. Yeah. Germany. Yeah, you didn't know the Mafia went after each other, huh? But do 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 do. Invaded Samoa and occupied New Zealand. It doesn't matter. Mm, no. Oh my but, god. Uh, um, Germany. Well, one of the reasons uh, they're going to be, you know, hooking up over there and, and interested is they want. Um, well, Germany had territories in in uh, in, uh, uh, in in the Pacific, 
right? As everybody did, everybody wanted colonies all over the place. And those were taken away. It's actually a reason why Japan ended up joining the allies is those German possessions in Asia. Uh, Japan was like, I think we would like to get those. So it seems to be the trend that whoever's going to lose this battle is going to lose their overseas colonies. So Japan joins the allies. Yes. And in a great irony, leaves that alliance and fights against those many of those allies in WW2. September 3rd, he died in the Battle no! of Lava in Austria-Hungary. September 6th. Stop what you're doing. And we need to give salutes to he. Moment of silence for him. All right, we have to continue. It's what he would have wanted. Grass feet. <laughs> September 9th, <laughs> he decided to attack He's Theobald He's von back. Bateman Hallweger. September 11th, the cost of war. October 10th, it's very expensive. Fred's battle. Yo, October Fred! October 12th, first Masonic war. And Wait, the, mice, the, the Masons are fighting each other now? I mean, they've been fighting everybody since the dawn of time, right? Conspiracy people? Even though the Freemasons don't go back all that far, actually. On October 13th, <laughs> endless war. It's for real. <laughs> Even though it's been 18th, three months. <laughs> there is no war in West Africa. November 6th. They the fought British basically everywhere. There's a lot of it in East Africa, for sure. Especially in East Africa, I should say. Indians lived in the mountains. That's true. December 8th. The Falklands Navy has taken over the destroyer Vaughn. Five is good. The Falklands. It's a pretty good number. They it's in the top to 10 Britain. best numbers between 1 and 10. December 14th. <laughs> Iranian War. The Turks defended the town of Shatur on Ottoman the Iranian Empire, border then. near the Caucasus Bridge. But after Lamb's victory... There's a bridge left. across the Caucasus December mountains. 18th. <laughs> finger attack. <laughs> December 24th. All they did, they dropped their guns and we're just like, doink, 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 Ow! To the 25th. Christmas truce. German and British soldiers secretly destroyed the nativity. Yeah, that's right. That's right. That's what the Christmas truce was. They didn't actually go out and play football, right? They actually went and just destroyed the nativities. January 18th. Japan is opposed to China's neutrality. He died in battle. This is the Again? second time he's died now. January 19th, Battle of Hartman's Vilikov. This is the end game. Hey, maybe that was a battle. I can't memorize every battle, especially German name ones that just go on forever. Like Hertzmann's Cop. January 24th, the Chilling Boy Rebellion was led by John Chilling Boy. <laughs> <laughs> Chilling Boy. <laughs> he's just chilling. He's that's, a, that's a great translation. Dude, they chill. All they do is sit back and just yell like insults of each other's mothers or something. They're just chilling, but they're like, oh, hey, your mom is so fat that even she couldn't conquer the Mongols. Oh, wait. Check out my Yo Mama uh, history jokes video. I don't want to give them away. Check that video out. He's just chilling. Super Some fun. more misinformation. January 28th, when the Ottoman Empire captured the Suez Canal. It did not capture the Suez Canal. It did not. <laughs> well, uh, important choke point. That's something you want to get involved. That's why, you know, one reason why the Ottoman Empire was so valuable to the central powers was, you know, first off, they control the Black, you know, the Black Sea. But then, um, although it's foreign owned still uh, at that time, the Suez Canal, they still are in control of Egypt at that time. January 31st. Germany well, was the first not fully. It's complicated, but yeah. this country to use chemical weapons in the Bolivian War. So they fought in Bolivia. Germany was the first to use those chemical weapons. What do you think that translation would be? Bavaria? Even that, that wouldn't be part of that part. It's on the Western part of that war. That'd be in the Western Front. What translation are they saying? Or should we just go with Bolivia? February 19th, Britons and Gauls invaded the, the Hellespont. The Battle of <laughs> Calipolis begins. The Gauls are back. March 10th, Great Britain fell and the Second Church War began. Churchill? In April Britain fell. I don't 28th. know where they're going. Maybe the some was criticism of back because he got fired, you know, from naval command and went to the front lines. <laughs> All right, what's this one? The Second Church War began <laughs> April twenty eighth. The first criticism of the military organization was successfully rejected. No thanks. No criticism here. Sure. April twenty ninth. <laughs> the Green War. May fifteenth. Gas. Some of the grass. The grass was the gas was more mustard gas though. So. They just don't want to pollute. Fishing. That's where I'm going fishing, boys. June 29th. <laughs> this is war. Okay. It's been a quite a few it's wars. Official. But this, this is war now. It's official. July 18th. Now war. The Capuchin bush is native to Italy. 
August 19th, Augustus <laughs> falls on Mount Akina. September 5th, Augustus is Zimowol, back from the dead. Member of the Swiss opposition in the European Parliament. They don't oppose anything. They don't propose anything. We all know Switzerland just chills. They chill in their mountains, but they fortify the whole thing. Don't mess with Swiss. September 25th, Battle of Hohenzollern Abbey in Los the Family Angeles. Hohenzollern. November 10th, yeah. the Chinese captured <laughs> different Syracuse though. and all the Those British captured. troops in the city. All. December 6th, <laughs> shipping to Costa Rica at the lowest prices. What you got to do? They always have to sneak little ads in there. December 18th. So is that, is that when, I mean, to go to Costa Rica, I guess you didn't have to use the Suez Canal, though. You think trade would be cheaper at this time? Capture of Gallipoli was a major victory. That never happened. <laughs> that was an epic failure by the British and uh, seemingly was supposed to ruin Churchill's career for ordering it. But nope, that was a, well, it, it's a major victory for the, the Ottoman Empire. You know, the Turks, the Turks specifically, uh, but not for the, not for, I'm sorry, the Anzac forces. I'm sorry, Australia and New Zealand. You absolutely fought uh, uh, valiantly, but you were sent on a suicide mission. For the Ottoman Empire and the Entente powers. Oh, for both Everyone's a winner. He corrected me halfway. January 21st, I will give you the first step of the cycle. March 8th, dagger yeah. battle. Kurt's escape attempt fails. Not even bayonets, just daggers. <laughs> 16 newspapers were published. That's it. Declare war on robots in the dark. I agree. May I agree. I do not trust the robots. Stop with the AI stuff. We are going to be destroyed. We have seen movies about this. Have you guys not seen Terminator before? It does not go if well. The Persians enter Mesopotamia from Russia, but it's too late. Everyone so, wanted that area. June 8th, Oil! The Austro-Hungarian cargo ship Prince Umberto sank in the Adriatic Sea off Italy. It was the bloodiest war in history. 1900 people died. We'll never recover. I mean, 1900's a lot, let's be fair, but um, yeah, you know, not Stalingrad, not Leningrad, not the Somme, not Verdun, the sip, ship sinking or whatever July, it was July, war for peace. Fresh he law, July 3rd, he married in Great Britain. Photographed back. by Got Albertus rid of the old wife. Vocius Ridge of the Battle of Vincent. He won. He, he deserved remarried. He deserved so who was he married to before? Was he married to she before? July yeah, 30th, was she the German video. soldiers attack a German bomb factory and destroyed the Black Jersey bomb. Good. August 3rd, all the, the bombs. Roman Wars ended with the defeat of the Ottomans and the British. August 6th, Battle of Duffield <laughs> That was too many different time, time spans into one thing. <laughs> Battle of the boys. The river. Yeah. August 27th, Romania boys. is at war with its allies. His army was defeated within a week. <laughs> this is the week he timeline, I'm pretty sure. September 7th. Yeah. Oh, oh, wait, wait, let's go back to the timeline. What's the key timeline? This is the week. Yeah, you're right, dude. And when we do the Cold War video, it, he, was on, he was on God mode. He was absolutely on God mode. I think I made like the Dr. Manhattan reference. Yeah, he kind of sucks right now. He's died like, twice in this he war. Died. Married like during the war. Like, come on. Come on, him. I'm, on, I'm pretty sure. September 7th. A bit of a fight. Just a little bit of a fight. September 12th. Not a very He violent. also built a church and a school in Thessaloniki. Okay. September 14th. Okay. World War 7. September 20th. They just skipped. They went from 1 to 2, 4, 5, 6, 7. Ah, oh, we're at seven now? Well, this is World War One. What was World War Two? Eight? Ninth. Flanders defeated the Romans yeah. in Latin. October 14th. Hey there, neighborino. Struggle with drugs. Yeah. December 7th. Prime Minister... Lo hey, check out my last uh, video. It needs, to, it needs to get more views. I was covering uh, the fat electrician for the first time, and you talk about the OD of the craziest OD story like I've ever heard of, of someone taking meth during World War II. Check that one out. Boy George urged the government to do more. He received a military commission from Mayor Maurice Hines and built <laughs> new buildings outside of the park. Prime Minister. December 18th, the Battle of Verdun was won by both sides. It was lost by both sides. I like using lost better because no man shall pass, right? How many people died uh, over a few yards? It's unbelievable. It's like the deadliest battle that had like no movement in it, probably in history. Crazy. Fields off, we're done. 
Everyone's a win in this war. I like it. No, everyone's a loser. December the 23rd to the 29th. Another Christmas war. This is when he started to make a name for himself, really. December 30th, assassination of a Russian actor, Grigory Putin. No. (laughs) January 9th. It's like Rasputin? (laughs) The British War of Independence drove the Ottoman Empire from the Sinai Peninsula. Independence from the Ottoman Empire? Yesterday, 50... Zanemskis were killed in Petrograd Square. Russian forces denied firing on the rebels. Council Sorry, of too the late Soviet Union Street. March 14th. The relationship between China and Germany is growing day by day. Aww. Except there wasn't. March 15th. Michael led and established the kingdom. March what 16th. Michael? In April. All of the Michaels? On Lenin Street. <laughs> Soviet Union Street and Lenin Street. I can see where they get the names from now. Dude, that was probably half of streets in the Soviet Union. <laughs> April the 22nd to May the 8th, World War II. April oh, 28th. It snuck in. World War II actually snuck in right in the middle between World War I and World War, World War I, World War Seven, World War I, and then World War II happened. The beginning of World War II, Phase Two, And then on April 29th, World War III. Oh, May the 3rd, okay. War in Saudi Arabia Two, <laughs> The long-awaited sequel. Maybe. Well, this is when the, well, the Arabians, the, the British are going to be getting the Arabians, uh, you know, we're under uh, 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 um, Lawrence, right? And uh, they rise up against, they, they, you know, work with their Arabs because Arabs were hoping to get independence from the Ottomans. Of course, the British, you know, T. Lawrence, they end up pretty much screwing them and they get nothing <laughs> and end up getting their territory just basically if, if, uh, Sykes Picode for the most US part. US Prime Minister Billy Hughes won the federal hey, hey, hey. election. See ya. June 12th, Constantine the First, King of Greece, expressed remorse. That's such mm, a big event. Well, everyone, everyone should be remorse. June 13th, stupid. London's first successful gutter gift scam. Wait, what is that? July 1st. What does that mean? Kerensky forgot something important. This was the last Russian battle. He left the stove right July here. 22nd, the Thai media reported on the German-Austro-Hungarian War. <laughs> Thailand just figured out that this war has been going on. It's been going on for three years already. But... This is a war. August 20th, some fought hard at Verdun. The other hey, guys were just lazy, okay? That's blasphemous. September 5th, Everyone fought well, Seedler's okay? tour of Fiji no, was hijacked by the French captain, Lottie. He got up. This is called karma. <laughs> September 26th, combat in the polygonal forest. <laughs> October 5th. The, the, war, she- the war has gone digital. <laughs> The war has gone digital now, okay. Oh, we got Six. some Easter Island. Combat we got? in the polygonal forest. <laughs> October 5th, the ship Fortune landed on Easter Island. Some casinos hate it. But all the natives October already 15th, committed cannibalism. Beat the king at work. A rock boy. <laughs> November 14th, fight in the jungle. It's all coming back! The global it's war. It's quite an all the time. November 17th, the 11th for the 12th, 2018. British troops have arrived in Jerusalem. 2018? In 2017? Again, I keep missing all these important events. Did that happen Crazy again? Here. The Br- December 11th, King Allenby sent British and Indian troops to Jerusalem. Yeah, they want to attack. He was born 300... They get it later. They end up putting the mandate in that whole region, so Britain will be getting a hold of that, and will pave the way for... Um, the Jewish migration, uh, and eventually, uh, or into Palestine, eventually paving the way to um, the creation of Israel after World War II, officially. All right, and we got British some more info Indian troops on him. To Jerusalem. He was born 300 years ago in the Ottoman Empire. Oh, okay. So this is given age of he is 300, 300 years plus. February. Hi, Jordan. It wasn't there Constantinople. February 19th, Battle of Jericho. Jericho arrested in England. <laughs> March 2nd, Kiwis well, and Kiwis cities. in Germany. It's either like the little birds or the fruit. March 4th, birds, this is Kansas. Kansas. Albert Herschel is hey, said to be the first Kansas. Spanish killed at Fort Funston. It's not so fun anymore. March 24th, <laughs> I was gonna make the same Papoom's thing. first battle was Operation at Michael. March 26th, Michael Rozier's resurrection. He's back, dude. Michael's March 28th, Michael's return. He's back. Final Always. year of the war. April 7th, the first result of the second part Anything of the Anything on the Russian Gets Revolution? Was disappointing. More on that later. April 18th, <laughs> War Duck is part of Operation George. <laughs> the 21st of April, posted by Red Baron on a Vox MM, 
it was the World War One social media at the time, Fox MM. May 14th, uh, okay. in a Chelyabinsk camp, a Hungarian well, prisoner Dolphin. married a woman from East Czechoslovakia. How dare Trotsky ordered How the dare. Czechoslovak army to attack and capture the city. Okay, he's running over the, the tracks now. Trans shipment failed. May 24th. Trotsky was all over. By the way, what do you think would have happened if it was Trotsky that really took over after Lenin instead? First, the Ottomans occupied the Armenian people. Genocided. Oh. May the 29th. Genocided. Reagan's War. June <laughs> Ray, 23rd. British and French troops landed in the northern Murmansk. Russian city of Murmansk. The Allies entered the Russian Civil War on Europe's side. <laughs> well, I mean, they're going to want to support the white armies later on, but that's later on in the 20s. Uh, we're getting all our timelines July wrong 4th. here. July 4th. The match all was Europe. over. You missed it. July oh. 15th. That's when the Christmas After War, the Christmas... Uh, the, the the Christmas battle or the 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 soccer match officially ended. It took four the years. The battle of Matrona and the final German invasion, Western Gaul was conquered by Germany <laughs> in August. They took it Spain. back from them. insurance. Caesar. Same rights in Freetown and Boston. Mm -hmm. August eighth, Hundred Years War yeah. in the West. Hundred Years War point two. It was so good they had to do another Hundred Years August War. August ninth, <laughs> Temple of War. This is the most war war there has ever been. Dude, there's September so much war 18th, in this war. During the third war with Iran, Bulgaria was annexed by Great Britain and Varda by Greece. September 19th, lose. They're always on the Jean losing side. loses her fight with Sharon. Bulgar Bulgaria. <laughs> <laughs> Jean completely annihilated Sharon. <laughs> Jean versus Sharon. October 4th, German President Woodrow was asked to train oh. with the USS Wilson. The Germans took all the gardens and okay. gave it to the government. <laughs> November, the government. I haven't studied the Spanish Civil War since the conquest of Spain. Cool, because it hasn't happened broke. yet. The November 1st, War. Battle of China, pre mouse Algon tomb. November 9th. Well, still Germany. a very destabilized time in China, right? They tried, that was the early years of the Republic when it was dysfunctional. Germany 2. Conquered the Emperor William. Project status. Hey, he, he gets 10th. booted out. He has Six to leave. Six years ago, Wilhelm. an agreement was signed with Germany. The race will end at 11 o'clock. The race? <laughs> the war is the race? I guess that could be translated as that. But it did 11, end at 11 a.m. on the 11th day of the 11th month. November 12th. Connie. A state declares itself a state. November 27th. The German army withdrew otherwise. from the Belgian army. I don't want from to know Belgium. what's going on there. <laughs> from Belgium. That already happened. It been kicked out by then. The January 25th. Make ideas, decisions to create a global community. It's true. Please. November 10th. Yeah, this is what they're talking about. And it's the conversation there at Versailles, right? They got to figure out how to make sure nothing else like this, ha this, nothing like this happens again. Maybe it's referring to the League of Nations? He was received at Buckingham Palace oh, by he got George V. Did he get on knighted? On the evening of December 10th and visited Buckingham Palace for the first time he got knighted, on November huh? 11th. He's now Sir He. Or him. I'll be back. Yeah. <laughs> awesome. All right. Final thoughts. All right. More of that lore. We got more he. We've got more uh, just completely inaccurate translations that r ruin the timeline and the places and the people involved, all to make that alternate reality where. We had multiple world wars within World War One. Uh, we saw he die a bunch of times. He sucked. He he was bad in uh, World War One, man. They were right. Like he peaked in the Cold War. I mean, if we're actually going to go chronological, he did, I guess, get better because it went like from World War One. Then he got more powerful in World War Two, and then he totally tops out in World War Three. So that'd be pretty great. You know, I was uh, for some of those translations that were bad. I wonder if it'd be a good idea in my class where I just like. Bring all bring a list of these translations and be like, all right, fix these translations. You'd have to learn about the war, right? And then have to fix it. I think that'd be a good exercise. What do you think about that as a class activity? All right. Uh, good job again to Starve Hard finding his own with this. You guys were, you know, as immediately when this came out, were trying to get me to to get on it quickly. So I appreciate Starve Hard letting me do that. But again, please make sure the original video got your view and subscription. Share that with people. Right. So um, we can help keep this up. And again, if you had not seen my other reactions to the Star of Our Bad, Bad Translation videos, as we finish up here, I'll post some of them around here that you can click on and, and check those out. 
And I don't know, what do you think should be next? What, what, what next should get the bad translation treatment? All right, let us know down below. And of course, let Starfarve know on the original video. All right, with that, we'll see you all next time.